Okay, I'm going, this is my first video for my K-Woman segment. I like watching Shonda Freeman. If you remember her, she's she was a fat man scoop wife on a husband and wife or man and wife. I forget the name of the show. It was a cute little web show. Now, she made this great video talking about women perception and representation. She was talking about how Kim Kardashian had her nipples exposed in a sheer top and how this Keisha woman, y'all, I don't watch the black reality show, so I don't know who this Keisha woman is. She has see-through outfit where you can see her butt. Now, I I was always taught that there was a time and a place for sexy clothes. I don't think a woman needs to show her, her every nook and cranny of her behind 24-7. Um, I know that you don't want this picture in your head, but I am a nudist and I walk around my house nude. Um, I when I go overseas once in a while, I walk around nude because they're nude. I go to nude beach, I love it. However, I know there's a time and place. I know that when I'm going for a job interview and I'm at a certain job and I'm at church, I might want to be more conservative. Or you know what? I get if you at the club wearing something revealing. But I don't understand wearing something with everything showing Monday through Sunday, no matter where you're at. That's just not appropriate all the time. Now, the other stuff she was saying was that young girls look up to Kim K and the girls, they should watch how they how they present themselves. And she and she was brought up a great point that women are not equal to men. Totally agree with that. I feel like women are more emotionally strong than men and men are more physically strong. It's a reason you need a man to move a refrigerator. And all of that stuff, okay? I, I'm not one of these women that, oh, I can do what a man do. No, I can't. No, 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 no. I can't. And I love how she made a point about a lady has to carry herself like a lady. Too many women get mad when these men make songs about bitching hoes, but it's kind of a hit dog or holler situation. You can't carry yourself like a bitch in a hoe and get angry when a man tells you you a bitch in a hoe. I never understood that. you. If you don't carry yourself a certain way, you can't demand a certain level of respect. Uh, she She's right. I agree that women cannot be slutty because they raised the kids. She didn't say that, but she was talking about Amber Rose talking about threesomes and she got a son. I mean, hey, what are you going to do when he's into that kind of thing? I, I I mean, I think that I, I will. Ex I'll, I'll explain it from my, my beliefs. I was raised Baptist. And in the church, they have a tendency to just tell you, do this, do that, and it's in the Bible, and that's it. They don't expound on nothing. Because um, they don't explain that the reason society is not as hard on a man as a woman is because the woman is the one with the kids. And if the woman ain't together, the kids is a hot mess. I hate to say this, but this is why people are having so many problems, and we have such a messed up generation, is because the women aren't picking better men. And they're not demanding that the men be men and be fathers to their children. And another thing, you know, if you like sleeping with everything in pants, that's great and wonderful. But you do not have to have a baby by these fools. Everybody's not father material. That, okay, and I was going somewhere else with that. Um, Basically, if you got kids, there's one thing to go to the club and be sexy. It's a whole nother animal to be sleeping with everybody in front of your daughter. And then another thing, when you bring all these men home around your daughter, what you teaching her? You teaching her to be loose, which ain't good for a woman. And you teaching her to use her body instead of her mind. You know, I feel like there's a time and a place for a woman to use her body and her mind. Um, that is all I have to say. I did agree with her that. People need to, women need to go back to the old school. I agree with the feminism. I think the feminism is great for your job, but I do not think it's good for your man, your romantic life. I, I don't think the woman hear me roar stuff is great for your dude. Okay, that's all I got to say.